Well, hey, YouTube, guess who? It's Elvis Ammo here. Hey, today I want to do a video on how to defeat the ATF on these pistol braces. So I'm going to try to make this real easy for you guys. And uh, I know that there has been a huge uptick in comments to the ATF on this subject, but we're not doing enough. And uh, so what I'm gonna do in, th in this video, in the description, and I'll, I'll probably even pin a comment with a, uh, a link uh, to the GOA website. And when you click on it, it should take you right to the form to send to the ATF. Um, now I know that the GOA is not the only game in town but they are an absolute no compromise organization that helps our 2A community. So please don't forget that. Don't overlook them by all means. If you're a member of the NRA or any of the other ones, become a member of the GOA too. That's what I'm going to say to you. Um, so anyway, uh, what we can do is exactly that. We're just not doing enough. Let's bombard them. These, uh, these, these pistol braces. Okay. Now there's a lot of people out there like we don't need the pistol braces and all that stuff. I understand. I do. I, I, I get it. I've heard some of the conversations, but listen, they don't want to just ban pistol braces. They want to ban you from owning a firearm. And you know that. And I know that. Okay. That's their goal to leave you toothless. That's the goal. So we can defeat that by getting involved. So I'm going to put a link um, in the description. I'm going to put a link in the comment section. And please click that and send that letter to the ATF. Because these pistol braces, all right, they were made uh, uh, legal by the ATF. There were several letters you know, stating that, no, these are just fine. And then, uh, you know, uh, hundreds of thousands and maybe over a million, maybe millions of these pistol braces later, all of a sudden, they're going to make you a felon for owning it. So if you paid a hundred bucks for this thing or whatever you paid for it, now all of a sudden, um, you're going to need to pay a tax stamp of $200 and apply to the ATF to own it. It's it's just bogus, okay? So they've already made it safe. People buy them. People buy weapons with them on there. People buy them and put them on there. And um, uh, it just don't make no sense that all of a sudden these are going to be illegal now, okay? This is just politics. Y'all know that. So please at least go and click this link and send that letter off. I promise you, for all you people that think it's not going to help, it will. You need to be involved. You need to be vocal. Um, that's the only way to defeat them, okay? So, uh, if you enjoy videos like this, give me a thumbs up, and that'll help me to realize that you guys like informative videos like this. But by all means, please, go click the link, send the letter to ATF. They need to know... We don't like that crap. I'll see you in the next video.